the first hypothesis was it's a skeleton, you know, you, or it's an associated individual. With that. Um, and, and we thought that for a long time, until yesterday when a second bone came out that was replicated in the skeleton. We're now up to multiple individuals. I don't know really how many, uh, and I don't know where it's going to stop, but we haven't even broken ground yet. Here's the half of the skull that we're going to be collecting right now. This is the top of the skull, and we believe that this is the front of the skull. It looks like there's what we would call a superorbital torus, or a brow ridge, right in this area. Therefore, that would be the face. What's happening right now is that uh, a scientist is taking photographs of the skull. It's been scanned in in high resolution, and they will start collecting these loose fragments of bone around here. So that's the first process. And then this team is going to move out. And I'm going to put in another team that specializes in the excavation process. Hopefully in the next few hours, this skull, which is now 30 meters underground, will be seen on the surface in the science tent.